saying, when you say in Israel to somebody you are an astronaut, you mean that he's not connected. So it's a kind of a joke. So I was laughing and uh, trying to understand if it's a joke or not. Crazy person you can meet on the road also. Somebody that uh, drives crazy can uh, kill you also. So I'm not worried about any crazy person. I mean, that's that's life. Right. Part of the life. The one here. It's not a full uh, fuselage. It's, it's only the crew compartment. And when I uh, I meet a lot of uh, Holocaust survivors, for instance, uh, people, Jewish people here in the United States, you can see in their eyes the glare and the, they really don't believe that that I am an astronaut because for them it's out of the world. So for Israel and for the Jewish community it's, it's a very symbolical uh, event. NASA has looked at that and, and found a provider that can provide uh, kosher food that we can use up in space. So I'm going to eat uh, kosher food up in space. Mission and liftoff of Columbia, reaching new heights for women in X-ray astronomy. Uh, don't break the end. Okay, Alan, Victor. This 